How to get free domain in 2024? Well, I'm gonna be honest, you can't. That's just not how domain systems work. And yet every website promising a free domain is gathering your data or frustrating you into buying premium. However, we can actually get a free subdomain address like this, or better yet, grab a top level domain for a few years for basically a few bucks. I'm gonna start with the easiest method. Get a free domain name with affordable hosting or just grab a super cheap domain. When you use something free, nothing is really stopping companies from taking it away. If you're at least 1% serious or interested in your web project, it's always better to have control and some legal claims. And hey, when one year is completely free and the others can be as low as a few bucks a year, well, the domain is basically free in my book. There are a lot of good providers, but if we're talking super cheap web hosting, but with a solid quality, then go with Hostinger. The first reason is that it comes with lots of resources. While Bluehost and Hostgator offer only 10 gigabytes of storage, Hostinger gives you 100 gigabytes of SSD for a more affordable price. The same is true with the website limit. I mean, 100 websites under one subscription does sound good. That's what, three cents a month for one website. If you want to know how to get free domain with other providers, I can't cover all of them, but make sure they clearly state that you'll get a free domain and also read up on the conditions for hidden fees. With hosting or free domain, there are no catches. Just go with the cheapest plan using my link below or type in cyber news at the checkout and choose your billing period. For the lowest price, you'll need to go with a four year payment upfront, but Hostinger comes with a 30 day money back guarantee. So you're not risking anything. Once you have an account, you can create a website and use a free credit to go through domain name registration. Now we can talk about a less convenient, more time consuming way of how to get free domain. I'll explain everything as we go along, but for now, know that providers like Freenom or similar websites are scams. It's as simple as that. They might promise you a free domain, but they are never available. They get stuck in a setup and do every single trick in the book to make you get a premium domain instead. So don't waste your time with that nonsense and let me show you a way to get a free subdomain. From a wide selection of addresses that FreeDNS offers, we can find something suitable like my.2. It's pretty short and simple to remember. To get started, visit freedns.afraid.org and sign up for a free account. FreeDNS will send you a confirmation email, so use a real email address. Once verified, click on Add Subdomain. Here we need to add your subdomain name. Think about it as your website title. For this example, let's go with Cyber Hosting. Next, select the main domain. You'll first get a few options. These are good, but might not be what you are searching for. Don't fret, there's a lot more of them. Just click here and select Domain Registry. Here you go, now that's a selection. Find the domain name that fits the best and select it. Now the next part, getting your destination or IP address might sound complex and with some hosting providers, it can definitely be. But if you're using modern hosting from Hostinger or Bluehost, this should be pretty straightforward. Discounts for both are in the description or as a QR code on the screen. I'm gonna use Hostinger for this demonstration. We want to create a new website and use a full URL we got for its domain name. Let's paste this right here and go straight to the dashboard. You'll see a message that the domain is not pointing to the Hostinger. Don't worry about it for now. Go to Hosting, Plans Detail, and copy the website's IP address right here. Jump back to FreeDNS and paste it into the destination field. Complete the CAPTCHA image and click Send. You can go back to Hostinger and use the Auto Installer tool to create a new WordPress or any other CMS type site. Complete a separate short setup and after a minute or so, your new website should be ready. Here's a website with a free subdomain name and it honestly can look like a top level domain to some. The last approach is best when you want to share your content online and don't want to have your own hosting. Use a website builder. There are now a few great website builder options that come with a free subdomain. For example, you can use wordpress.com to create a free blog and get an extension like this one. It's also a good choice since it comes with most of the features that regular WordPress is so famous for. Thousands of themes, plugins, and widgets. Another option is Wix Website Builder. This is probably the most extensive platform for both professionals and beginners alike. You can create a website with a free plan and use it forever. One plus of Wix is that you can create virtually any website, not only a blog. They will have Wix advertisements on them though, and you can't sell, but that's to be expected from a free domain. You don't need to do anything extra to get the subdomain, just create a website. 
its name will go in this place. So your full address will look something like this. Other builder recommendations include Hostinger for simple light website crafting and Squarespace for more stylish modern sites. All right, that's all I have to say for today. Remember, don't fall for free domain scams. Save your time and grab a functioning subdomain through free DNS or a website builder. Alternatively, you can save your time and money by grabbing a hosting plan with a free domain name from affordable providers like Hostinger or Bluehost. So thanks for watching my free domain 2024 explainer video. If you have questions or suggestions for the next topic, feel free to leave them in the comments. You can find more cyber news by subscribing. Liking this video also gives you karma points. Anyway, that's all for now. I'll see you later.